California back-to-back -back NCAA championships. The Bears. I think it took time to reflect on the on the season. And, you know, kind of the ups and downs of a season, and the ups and downs of even the championship, and and different women stepping up at different times. I mean, this was really rewarding and um, very um, just tremendous leadership, particularly from the seniors that um, I and all year that really reflected in a performance. Uh, uh, you know, a uh, elite level performance when when you're supposed to have one. So that's very gratifying. In 09, when we won, we were kind of looking around and, you know, what do you do now? Where do you, what, what do you? And, and this time it's like we we're just little professionals up there, knowing, you know, kind of calculating which pool we're gonna go in and how we're gonna do it. And and I don't know. At the last minute, we all just it was like, let's do it together, you know, and just one, two, three, and all jumped. And and when we were in the water. Um, Sandy was still up on the platform, so she got to dive in when um, when we were all in the pool. And it's um, you know it's it's a little awkward to go swimming with your with your clothes on, but it's definitely a really really um, special tradition. In the next couple days, I want to make sure I don't get too crazy about moving forward, but just kind of take it in and and um, and in, enjoy and celebrate and remember and and kind of put those moments in your your personal memory bank that keep you motivated when it's hard to get up in the morning or, or whatever, um, you know, the, the times when it's, when you do have to make a decision between being good and great, like those are the moments that all of us need to tap into and it will keep us going. One of the things we had talked about is that we wanted this class to go to an NC2As and get a trophy every year and, and really with Leaf and Sarah and and um, Shelly in particular, they're, they're going to have three championship trophies. and. Um, out of the four and you know Colleen and Catherine are, are transfers but um, huge pieces of, of um, particularly the last two championships so it's pretty pretty exciting for all of them. This is my 20th year and I've never seen a Cal diver compete at a national championship and um, really excited about that because that, that piece of our program we've, we've been trying to elevate it and and had a few hiccups and, and I'm really excited for Todd in particular and his leadership and, and Kaylee and, and the seniors on that team, Molly Hayes and Alyssa Barker have really kept that team together through some very challenging um, challenging times. So Kaylee's performance is a reflection of that as, as well. Every young lady that's going to join us in the fall has emailed or text or following, you know, following the meet and they're already really um, invested in in the program at, you, you know and their families or I got uh, some from their parents and um, it's a, a great group of women um, Todd's gonna bring in a couple more divers and um, you know it's it's it, I, I think we're really at a place where the 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 right people are 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 coming here you know women that are uh, interested in world-class academics and world-class swimming and are willing to do the things day in and day out so that, that we can, they can be successful and see how good they, they want to be and that, that's what I'm excited about. I remember going into people's homes and saying that, you know, my goal was I wanted to win a national title at the number one public institution and have the highest team GPA in doing it and, and to be honest, I really never thought it was going to happen, but that was how I was going to make decisions, you know, that, that I wanted to find women that were willing to say, hey, I want to be the best at the best place. And, and um, I think that, that the women now that want to come here and be part of that know that this is not a, a road for the fair-hearted, you know, that this is someone um, that is going to be challenged in the classroom and challenged out in the pool and in the weight room and, and that, that that challenge and that competitiveness has got to bring out the best in you. And, and um, it's it's pretty exciting that it, it's this is more than I it's almost more than than I I don't even think I could have dreamed this.